The FDA has cleared a groundbreaking new cancer vaccine for phase three clinical trials. The new treatment is known as a tumor lysate particle only vaccine. People get sick from cancer because the body thinks that tumor cells are normal cells, so it doesn't fight them. Traditional treatments like chemotherapy end up killing both cancer and non-cancer cells, which leads to side effects like nausea, hair loss, vomiting, and so on. So how does this vaccine work? The vaccine helps the body differentiate between good and bad cells. It makes tumor cells appear as if they are harmful to the body, which stimulates the immune system to eliminate them. Each patient's vaccine is personalized by using samples from their tumor to create a custom vaccine. And how successful is that? In phase two clinical trials, nearly 95% of stage three and stage four melanoma patients who received just the vaccine were alive three years later and 64% were still disease free. This is a major deal. And to break it down a little bit better for you, among stage four cancer patients, the disease free rate was 68% compared to 0% in the placebo group. So the evidence that this vaccine works is incredibly strong and the side effects were minimal, just redness and pain at the injection site, a little bit of fever sometimes, and fatigue. That is a lot better than the side effects that you get with chemotherapy and radiation. So this could be a really promising development in the search for a cure. Yeah, you know, cancer is a real bummer. It's like there's not one person that doesn't know someone that's not been affected by it or died from it. So I would hope that at some point in our lifetime there is some sort of thing that makes it better or cures it all right. So, you know. I guess this could be a positive story, although there are a lot of people that are terrified of all vaccines, so what a world. Yeah, and people who are terrified of vaccines, let's just see what happens. If they get cancer and they're presented with these amazing statistics, let's see what route they choose. If you're, if you're presented with life and death, maybe you're gonna be a little bit more likely to take the vaccine, or you'll just go back to using traditional treatments that maybe are not as effective and have worse side effects, but at least you'll have options. If you like this episode, be sure to subscribe for more stories like this. Thanks for watching, I'm Brigida.